federal government can't create jobs except to further bloat the fraudulent, corrupt, power-abusing Fedzilla beast that has about 5,000 people to do the job of what my drum tech could do. My parents disciplined me and guided me, forced me, that's called parenting, to be the absolute best that I could be. Now, my dad didn't beat me when I didn't paint the fence perfect, but he'd walk me out there and go, what's that? That looks like a spot you missed. What's with all the spilled paint on the lawn? Try it again, pal. It was awesome. So I'm born in Detroit. It was beautiful. Neighbors watched over neighbors. There was a sense of definitive independence and rugged individualism. I have witnessed this wonderful American dream of united patriotism and instinct to, and drive to be as productive as possible. I've seen it deteriorate into a welfare nation where people that aren't needy just want their fair share. Government who refuses to be accountable. Taxing a segment of society who's already paying all the taxes. A government who openly spends more than you could possibly ever substantiate. It creates needy. It rewards greedy. It rewards slovenliness and gluttony and criminality. There's a huge and rejoiceful wake-up call in this country because worse than evil is the apathy that facilitates it. And I find that diminishing, it's decreasing. More and more good men and women are standing up and saying something. And I pray to God they say it in November at the voting booth.